Thank you, Dad, for always being there, helping me. It means a lot, and I love you a ton. But I know I was loved, I'm loved, and uh, very happy about that. But it was a habit, her artwork, it was a stress reliever to her. These are not the happy things you want to remember someone by. We had both, Andrea and I, had watched the 93 bombing and how terrible that was. And, you know, that in the back of our minds, she was nervous about the trip. She was up and the 92nd floor, and actually when the plane hit, she was on the phone with her fiance, Al, in Chicago, describing the view of uh, the Statue of Liberty. And there's now 100 million people in America who have, were not around when 9-11 happened. You know, if they can learn and begin to appreciate that, yeah, these people were loved. They, the effect of something like this hatred has a ripple effect forever. Success rate against Al-Qaeda defendants. They're scary. I don't know how it could ever enter anyone's mind to have any sympathy for these people. My life has not been the same since September 11, 2001. It, my life has been September 11, 2001. One of the hardest uh, things to describe to people is missing someone. I just miss her presence, her humor, uh, her love. You know, the time between Andrea and I are not that great. And I try and keep that a happy thought. We always said we'd find each other.